back here at the ballpark, ready for the bottom of the eighth. Max Muncy at the dish. New pitcher now, Tim Hill. And they felt it was time to bring on a left-handed reliever from the pin with the lefty hitter coming up. I think it's a good move. I know I never liked when opposing teams did that to me. And a pitch. Ball one, one no strikes. And another two ball. ball. No two count. count. Great hitter at the dish. If you're going to miss, you've got to miss outside the zone. You miss inside the strike zone, you'll be asking the umpire for a new baseball. Oh, Just count. missed. So definitely a little wild right out of the gate. Well, it could be a little tough coming from the bullpen mound to this mound, but you've got to find a way to get ahead in the count quickly. He hasn't. We'll see how this at bat turns out. Good plate appearance there. Able to take the walk. Boog, if I were him, I'd be nibbling around the plate as well. I mean, this guy is just capable of hitting pitches outside of the zone and driving them a long way. Muncie on at first. Nobody out. That one hammered center field. That's back there. He blasts one out to center, and they're chipping away. It's 8-6. So digging in, Jason Hayward. Swings and misses. That's strike one. There's a swing and a drive. That's back there. And it's gone. He made him pay for that one, and they slice into the lead. It's 8-7. Chris Taylor steps to the plate for the Dodgers. So out of the pen comes the right-hander, Luis Garcia. He's into the game with the bases empty. And he swings and misses at the initial offering. That one missed. And here it comes. Swing and a miss. One and two. Fooled on that pitch. Got a little anxious. And now in a two-strike count, he's going to have to widen out his stance, choke up on the bat, and really make sure he has pitch recognition before pulling the trigger. Righty to the plate. Good eye right there. And the tying run is on base. How big a deal is that walk? I don't think it's a big deal because if you pitch to the previous hitter with the power he has, you can hit a home run. I think it was a calculated walk. We'll see how it pays off here. Peralta, the next to hit, takes ball one. Runner at first with no outs here. Next pitch way upstairs. If you're a base runner, you've got to stay dialed in here. Look for anything in the dirt. Try your best to get in the scoring position. Left-hand batter waits. Pitch misses. Three balls, no strikes. With a single base runner, because of all the power, they are dangerous to tie this thing up or take the lead. And there's ball four. That just came apart right there. Four-pitch walk, and the guy at the plate was not going to help him out by swinging at something out of the zone. James Outman steps to the plate for the Dodgers. And the first pitch misses for ball one. Well, this is a critical spot for both the pitcher and the hitter. You can learn a lot about a guy by how he handles these pressure situations. Swing and a miss. Bringing the cheese on that one. Got him swinging. 
Here's Mookie to hit. Lots of pop at the plate. Outfield playing back almost on the warning track. Swing and a miss. Strike one. That was the pitch to hit. Four seam fastball instead of that sinker ball that makes you hit it on the ground. He missed a good one. And that one almost got him. Straightened him up a little bit. The 1-1. One, one. It's a big opportunity right here, but I love the way he's slowing the game down. He's shrinking his zone, making sure he gets the pitch that he wants to hit. Up and in, and he gets out of the way. First pitch strike from the pitcher, but then no panic at all by the hitter. Very patient, showing good discipline. Now he's in the driver's seat with a 3-1 count. And that'll load the bases. Walks out of the bullpen can absolutely kill your momentum very quickly. They're in some hot water trying to protect this lead. So bases loaded with one away. Freddie Freeman getting ready to hit. There's a strike. He's looking for a ground ball to get a double play and out of this jam. To the right side. And it's through for a hit. One runs in. Tatis fires it to the plate. Peralta caught the rundown now. And he's out at third. Couldn't get back to the base. Will Smith steps to the plate for the Dodgers. Known for his late inning heroics. And he swings and misses, and it's nothing at one. And that one is lifted in the air. And it's caught. And that ends the inning. Back here at Chavez Ravine. Here's the left fielder, Juan Soto. Brazier back to work. Swing and a miss. Up the middle. Rojas with the throw to first. They get the out on Soto. Now here's Xander Bogarts now. No matter what, when you're playing this kind of rival, you take your game to another level. Freeman under it. And there's two away. Boy, that was a hanging breaking ball right there. I think he tried to do a little bit too much. Sometimes those eyes can get really big. I think his swing broke down as well, and that's what caused him to pop it up. Machado stands in with two away as he takes a ball. And it's even up. One and one. That misses off the outside edge. Now you get to this part of the order. Yeah, there's some pop there, but more likely there's some base hits. So very important to be patient. Let the pitcher walk you, if he will. Whips it to first, and that'll do it. Back here in L.A., and now Max Muncy. Right hater back to work. And ball one. Ball one, no strike. Swings through that. From a pitcher's perspective, that's a beautiful splitter right there. As a hitter, you don't like it. But he's commanded his fastball, and out of that same tunnel, that splitter comes, and the bottom just falls out of it. Swing and a miss. Two and two. Just completely full on the breaking ball right there. Had no chance. Next offering is fouled back. 
Pretty good pitch there to take a rip at. He wants to get his arms extended. He likes the ball away from him a little bit, just not able to square it up. Hacks and misses. It's a strikeout. Here's J.D. Martinez. Swings through that one. 0 oh and 1. Well, a come and get me fastball right there. He didn't look ready for the velocity. I think it'd be a mistake to throw him anything off speed right here. Fair ball. The throw into second. No, he stays. There you go. Winning run is aboard with one down. Just found a way to slap that ball down the third baseline. That's really excellent back control. And it kind of goes back to all those drills you see hitters do off the tee where it's placed in different spots. That was just nice. Miguel Rojas at the plate. Ripped into center base hit. Ball back in in a hurry, and the winning run now at second with only one away. Always feels amazing getting a job done when the team needs you to come through. It's just bigger than your own individual stats. Good extension on that swing. Took the pitch on the outside part of the plate and drove it up the middle. He let it travel just oh, enough. Taylor swings through it for strike one. Owen oh, two as he waves at that one. At the dish, looking to lift the ball in the air in this spot. Anything but the inning, inning double play, boo. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Gassed it right by him. Now the left fielder, David Peralta. It's a good spot to be in with runners on first and second. You know the pitcher is going to come after you. And that one just misses. A ball and no strikes. And it's one and one. That split is a pretty nasty pitch. Explodes out of the hand. Looks like a fastball. And the bottom just falls out of it. That misses the zone. Now two balls and a strike. Winning run and scored position with two away. Two balls, two strikes to count with two outs. He's been great in this one. Eye-hand coordination just failed him a little bit right there. Swing and a miss struck him out. On to extra innings. And here's the first baseman, Matt Carpenter. And a pitch. Ball one, no strikes. That's a slider for a strike. Swing and a miss. And a count one and two. Wow. Good luck catching up to that one. Got him swinging. It's a strikeout. Couldn't hit the fastball at the knees. And now the DH, Nelson Cruz. Well, first base open. Really no reason to pitch to this hitter right here. Put him on. Have the force at second first. Perhaps getting any ending double play. Ground ball left side. Fires across the diamond. Two in a row set down to start the 10. Now it's the second baseman, Jake Cronenworth. Showed a really nice opposite field approach in his last at bat. Edge of the zone for a strike, and it's 0 and 1. Now a pitch hitter coming on for the Padres. Ha Sung Kim, a critical at bat in this game for him. And the lefty with the 0-1. He swings and fouls one off. The 0-2. Taylor. Padres go down 1-2-3. On 
to the bottom of the 10. And at the plate for the Dodgers, James Outman. A new arm into the game, the righty, Nick Martinez. And a pitch. To the right side. Kim with the throw to first. And here in the 10th, the leadoff man is out. Now it's Mookie Betts. If you don't get ahead in the count, you can forget about having any success against him. These fans don't like to see that because they showed up to watch him swing the bat. But well, this team does not want to let him beat him. Two on, one out. Freddie Freeman steps to the plate for the Dodgers. RBI intentional pass coming. Bases now loaded, though it does set up a force at every base. One down. Digging in, Will Smith. Well, all eyes on the double play ball in this spot. No better way to get out of this inning. And he swings and misses at the initial offering. Okay, swing now. He had his mind made up. As soon as that ball left the hand of the pitcher, he was going to swing at it. Swing and a miss. And that's strike two. Swings and misses. Struck him out. Couldn't hit the fastball at the knees. Here's Max Muncy. That funky Muncy. A strikeout and a walk. And he swings and misses, and it's nothing in one. Guy out there sees a power hitter take that kind of swing. He's got to be thinking, is this guy trying to set me up? Now let's see if he can make an adjustment. And he's down 0-2 as he swings through it. A little anxious, a little aggressive early in the count. Too much for me. And a swing and a miss. Huge strike out there. here at Dodger Stadium. 11th inning set to get underway. So digging in now for San Diego, Austin Nola. The pitch. Swing and a ball lifted in the air. Shallow left field. Racing makes the catch. And there's one down. Here's the center fielder, Jose Azucar. So he came up clutch earlier in this ball game and really just needs to take the same approach. Think hard right back up the middle. You'll one. Catcher tosses the mask, settles under it, brings it in, and there's two down. Back to the top of the lineup. Another batter now, Fernando Tatis Jr. Swings through that one. 0 oh 1. Well, that's today's style of baseball right there, right? Big time velo on the bump and big time pop at the plate. And that is that. We're in extras here. Now it's the DH, JD Martinez. So a big opportunity here with the score tied and that runner on second to start the bottom of the inning. Yeah, and you know they're eager to cash in. You just don't want to come out of your shoes and make a mistake. Got to play this smart. Next pitch is downstairs. One ball, one strike. Line drive. Azokar hauls it in for the out. One away. It was all over that fastball right there. I tell you what, if he gets under it just by a fraction of an inch or a little bit more, that's way back. Rojas swings through it for strike one. Well, you can't offer it that pitch in an 0-0 count. It's a strike, but not every strike is a good strike early in the count. Next offering, pop foul off to the right out of play. 
The 0 2. And there's a ball. Strike three. Got him swinging. That's the second out. And next for LA, Chris Taylor. Oh, how he'd love to walk it off right here. Strike one. Clearly oh all in God. on the fastball right there, but it was a changeup. Bottom just fell out of it. He's going to have to make an adjustment. That misses, and it's a ball and a strike. The pitch. And another ball. Winning run stands at second. That one ran inside, almost got him. The pitch. And now it's filled up. And a swing and a miss. The hat trick. And good work there as he gets a one, two, three. Welcome back. Now the number two hitter, Juan Soto. Phillips back to work. That one's in there. It's 0 1. And he chases a high fastball there. Well, you know this guy wants a pitch off, something that he can hit hard and drive over the wall. But you've got to set your sights down a little bit. You can't lose your discipline and go after a pitch that you just can't do anything with. And a ball evens the count. Well, he's not afraid to fall into a two-strike count. Knows the strike zone very well, so much so. Here's the pitch. Runner breaks for third. Fights it off, you'll see another. That's towards center. And there's one down. And here is Xander Bogarts. Listen, there's absolutely no reason to pitch to this guy right here. You nibble, you see if he'll expand. He's trying for third. Ball misses. And the throw, he's out of third. All tied up and here in extra innings. Bogart's retired, and that will end the inning. here at the ballpark. Now here is David Peralta. The pitch. Swing and a miss. Ugly swing right there. Slapped foul. Oh and two now. Got him swinging for the strikeout. Pulled the string on the changeup. James Outman steps to the plate for the Dodgers. And first offering is fouled off. That misses off the outside edge. Swing and a miss. One and two. One away, and the game winning run stands at second. Cut on and miss. Struck him out, and two away now. Back to the top of the Dodgers order. Here's Mookie Betts.
first pitch swinging. He got away with one there, but he knows he can't go into that spot very often against a guy like this. Strike two. No ball, two strikes. The pitch. And that one got a piece of him. These types of mistakes usually turn out to be costly this late in the ball game. Things can really slip away in a hurry. Freddie Freeman steps to the plate for the Dodgers. And a foul ball. Taylor, the lead runner out at second. Betts at first, two out of the inning. Next one is off the plate. And one and one. Line drive, could be extra bases. Runner around third on his way to the plate. In comes the winning run, and the Dodgers win it in 12. So exciting to see a team walk it off. Not so much fun if you're on the other side, but what a great